Well, there's nothing that we can put on the table that can rival the measurements of the universe. And we are literally composed of stardust. So when people think they're different, they have DNA in common with all of the life forms on Earth. Like, you have 20% identical genes to a banana. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we all do, not just you. And that's not all. There are molecules that went in and out of your lungs that are in China being breathed by people there. And go further back, Jesus inhaled them. So how's that for oneness with others? That can't be true. And that's the next problem. People value what they think is true more than what is true. That's a recipe for the unraveling of civilization as we know it. But as a scientist, show me the data. And as someone that knows so much about the universe and objective truth, I've got a lot of questions. So what do you think is the probability of me getting to another planet in my lifetime? And then could you make the case that the universe is simulated by some sort of advanced life form? And also, did humans evolve at some point to believe? And do you think you would be happy? Oh, so you're gonna spice this up a bit. Okay, so. I see messages all the time in the comment section that some of you didn't realize you didn't subscribe. So if you could do me a favor and double check if you're a subscriber to this channel, that would be tremendously appreciated. It's the simple, it's the free thing that anybody that watches this show frequently can do to help us here to keep everything going in this show in the trajectory it's on. So please do double check if you subscribed and uh, thank you so much because in a strange way you are, you're part of our history.